What's up, Jasper Nation, and welcome back to Between Two Pipes. I'm your host, Matt Descola, and today I'm here joined by junior long stick midi, Pat Reddle. How you doing today, Pat? Good. How are you, Matt? Good. So I guess we'll uh, get the interview started today. Uh, what was it like being a walk-on here at Manhattan College? Was it, I'm sure it's a little bit of a different experience than most guys have. Yeah, being a walk-on, it was fun. Uh, it was great to like meet all the guys and then like make my decision to walk on. And then that whole process was just like trying out, being on the field and just showing what I could do. Cool, cool. And what's your uh, favorite place to eat around here in the Bronx? Um, Sal's of Soho. I really like that place. A little Italian food. Yeah. That's what you like, a Jersey guy. Yeah. Makes sense. Uh, so first, uh, a little bit of a funny question here. Excluding Dwayne The Rock Johnson, because I think he would be the most obvious answer, if you were dropped on a deserted island with nothing to help you, which two celebrities would you bring to survive? Um, being a Giants fan, I think I have to go Saquon Barkley first. He can do it all. And then uh, my next guy is John Tapper. He's okay, like, why about that? He's like a man who could solve a problem. So I think having him and Saquon and me would just be a good trio. Yeah, just go to work. Yeah. I understand that. So, uh, back by popular demand is this question. What do you think is the fiercest animal you could take in a fight? Hmm, this one. I think the fiercest I could go is a bald eagle. They're pretty mean, and yeah. maybe I could take them on. Okay, sounds good. And uh, what superpower would you like to have the most? A uh, superpower I'd like to have is be able to read someone's mind, mind reader. Yeah. You know, be one step ahead. Okay, I like that. One more question here. If you could only eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Being a Jersey guy, love our bagels. I think it's bacon, egg, and cheese for me on an everything bagel. Okay, I like that. And uh, I'm sure a lot of the guys on the team have heard you say this and talk about it. Uh, you say the term Jersey grit a lot. Could you explain yeah. that for me? Well, being from Jersey like yourself, it's kind of something you just have, you're born with, and you really can't explain it. Like, if you're from Jersey, you know it, you know what it is, and... If you're not, it's just like not attainable and you just wouldn't understand. Yeah, that makes sense to me. I guess if you're not from Jersey, it may not make sense to you, but that's just the way it is. That's the way it is. Thank you for joining us today on Between Two Pipes. I'm Matt Descola, and we'll see you next time.